Greetings ladies and gentlemen, today video I'm going to uh, teach you how to read the saturated, compressed and superheated table. So wow. I'm going to go through a few questions in the tutorial. So this is a uh, number 6. Uh, complete the following table. The substance will be H2O or water. So this is the table that I'm going to uh, deal in today. Been given that the pressure, the, the temperature would be 15, and the uh, specific volume would be 4.16 meter cube per kg. So, been asking what is the pressure and the phase. This is the, for the first row. So, we have to answering that question. This is my answer. We need to refer to a at this condition a4 or a5 table. Always keep in mind when you are dealing with that kind of problem, you need to always refer to saturated water because every single information uh, that the problem that we are dealing with, it must have uh, either saturated water or compressed or secreted uh, table. It is must be some 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 place around those table so it just logic to say if we were looking at the saturated water table and we didn't find out the value so we need to find out uh, it must be at the compressed or the superheated water table so always keep in mind that if you were dealing with this problem always refer to this saturated table uh, saturated table first so at this question 15 degrees C at the 15 degrees C been given 4.16 um, specific volume. So there is the A4 table at the 15 degrees C. That will be the where is the uh, there is a specific volume. The specific volume in the question will be 4.16. It is something around uh, 0.001012 till 12.026. So indeed, uh, this uh, water were in the form of mixture, saturated mixture, in the form of saturated. In the saturated, you will have a three state: saturated water, saturated uh, vapor, and mixture, something in between. So the specific volume is something in between F and G. So it is will be in, in the form of mixture. I already make a video about what is the VF and VG. So if you want to know what is the, what it is, you can refer to that video. So it is in the form of mixture, saturated mixture. So, did I have a 12.352 kPa? Because if you took, uh, taking a look uh, to the pressure, saturated pressure, thus you will have a uh, 12.352 kPa. So, that is the answer for the first row. And the second row, been given the pressure that will be 200. And the phase, uh, the problem that when you, when the, the, the question given us, the first, uh, it is just uh, very very easy to solve because we know what is the table that we need to refer. So saturated vapor. So you need to refer in the uh, in the saturated uh, table. Either it is a four or a five. So saturated vapor been given the pressure that will be two hundred kPa. Just straight away go to the saturated at the. Uh, 200 kPa. So there is the temperature, uh, the temperature table. So we go to, to the A5 table. In the first column there will be in the form of uh, pressure in the, uh, in the unit kPa. So the pressure will be 500, uh, 200 kPa. At the 200 kPa, um, at 200 kPa ah. at 200 kPa there is the table right so been asking what is the uh, temperature so according to the table there will be 120.1 in the form of degree C so there you can have a 120.1 in the form of degree C the value of V since that it is a saturated vapor so you need to refer to uh, VG, then you will get 0 
kg per meter meter cube per kg so there you can have 8.8578 so we go through to the third column been given at the temperature it will be 250 and the pressure it will be 400 so in this condition we need to refer a four table or you can refer to the uh, PKP, uh, pressure table also but I need I, I want to refer a four table so a four table 115 degrees C so lift up this line 115 degrees C oh. 215 degrees C so at a 215 degrees C at 215 degrees C uh, 215 degrees C the pressure will be 3976.2 kPa so according to the Question given, there will be 400 kPa. Since that, the pressure that we were dealing with, the respect to T separated, were lower than 3976.2. So this uh, condition, you need to refer to um, superheated table. So superheated table, A6. Uh, table what is the pressure there will be 600 400 kPa you need to convert into megapascal because uh, in this table we are using a megapascal so you will get 0.0, 0. 1 2 3 0. 0.4 0. 0.4 megapascal so this in here so make a line 0. 0.4 megapascal and at the condition of 200 and 15 degrees C so the value that will be uh, been asking what is the question specific volume specific volume 0 0.59520 so there is the answer 0 0.59520 in the fast of separated water so the last but, non but nonetheless uh, we go to the 110 so refer to A4 table straight away A4 table and 101 and 110 degree C and 110 degree C what is the value for pressure 110 degree C the value for pressure the P separated will be 143.38 but pressure that we were dealing were 600 kPa so the pressure were higher than P separated at given temperature so we need to refer in this case compressed liquid I am already uh, explained about uh, maybe some of you may get confused uh, how to play how how do you know which table that you need to refer uh, either separated or compressed i'm already explained it a uh, little bit of tips in the previous video so we just going through through the compressed liquid which is a7 table compressed liquid so the minimum pressure for compressed liquid will be uh, 5 megapascal but we were dealing with 600 kPa if we convert into um, megapascal it will be 0 0.6 megapascal so the information the spec doesn't state in the table A7 so how did we want to find out what is the specific volume? Indeed, the first there will be in the form of uh, compressed liquid. Compressed liquid, but how did I know what is the specific volume? In this condition, 
diri the separated and the uh, compressed separated uh, graph you can see there is a graph like a hill that is the illustrate the separated fast and we have a line right there a line graph that will be stayed as a saturated line at the saturated line as you can see there is the uh, intercept between both of these graph here and there so at this point it is the uh, it is the compressed liquid form so as it's close to the uh, uh, the, 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 the saturated graph the value will be approximately to this one so that's why we didn't have any information about uh, 600 kPa at the compressed liquid table which is actually the doesn't state because the property of it it is just approximately equal to saturated so in this case there will be pressure and because we have a two table for saturated pressure and temperature so I don't want I need to refer either is a temperature table or pressure table I'm, I'm didn't quite uh, uh, remember what is the pressure that need to refer either is a temperature or pressure saturated temperature or saturated pressure but I'm assuming it will be uh, P saturated so at the P saturated we need to refer a 5 table a 5 table so there is a 5 table uh, since that we will delete with 100 kPa we need straight to uh, 600 kPa which is in here so what is the uh, V since that the condition where it is compressed liquid so we need to refer VF so the property uh, for VF saturated pressure water will approximately to compressed liquid so the value will be 0 0.001101 so that's why the answer will be 0 0.001101 for the compressed liquid at 110 degrees C uh, and at 600 kPa so I think that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you didn't have any advice for me, I'm gladly accept it. And have a nice day. Bye bye.